Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Pastiche of Skins. Uh, first 15 minutes, and this time, for the first 15 minutes, we are checking out the Final Fantasy 15 demo that's been posted up on the game. It's all of the game, up onto our, um, uh, onto our demo section of PSN. And um, I didn't know about this appearing. Uh, I was literally walking through the demos and free-to-play stuff for a friend of mine's to kind of show him the bits and pieces he could play on PS4 and spotted this, and I am unbelievably excited so i don't know what to do myself um i'm going to let the english dub speak for itself here on the ordinary and we'll see how this goes <laughs> i'm i'm really really worried because all i've seen or final fantasy 15 is a, a lot of the video footage of the um this the kind of fight where odin summoned for the first time a bit of the wandering around in the car i don't know what to make of the Final Fantasy 15 setup as it is now. I don't. I don't know what. I don't know what this is. I don't know what I'm looking forward to. So this is the platinum demo Final Fantasy 15. I, well, I love the fact they actually have order listed in there. Total play time one minute. Um, okay, I have to take a quick look in the options menu to see what kind of crack is in here. Audio language selected, text language speakers, uh, master volume. I'm going to bring that down a slight bit just to make it a little bit easier for us to hear me over the top of the gameplay. Um, Voice volume, subtitles are on, names are on, brightness is at 50. I might just turn that up a tiny touch so we can... Because, of course, YouTube tends to actually mess up with that. Uh, vertical camera, normal, uh, these are for inverted and stuff. Nope, that's all good. I'm a little bit concerned because that menu screen looks very, very like Final Fantasy XIII. Um, very, very utilitarian, but I'm not too sure what to do with this. Oh, God. Right, new game. Final Fantasy 15, do not disappoint me, please don't. And what the hell is Carbuncle doing on the front screen? <laughs> and his magical guide as you explore the fantastical world of his dreams. A sneak peek of the excitement to come in Final Fantasy 15. So Noctis and Carbuncle are magical friends? <laughs> okay, I'm assuming this is kind of like almost like a prequel part where it's um, Noctis before he's actually like grown up. Okay, scary screamy voices and searching for things. I'm Is this Sanji inside his own head or something? Something bad must have happened. But here's our GRPG G antagonist. Good music though, I'm actually enjoying that. What is this place? <laughs> Good question. Okay. Is that a Sony Xperia? <laughs> no. What is... Th okay, so um, I've got my phone. That's good. As long as I have my phone, I'm okay. Ah, uh, um... Whoa! So he's... That's weird. Chocolate car... <laughs> Carbuncle can telepathically send text messages? That's genius! Hey, wait! I'm, I'm loving this. This is the world of your dreams, okay. Wow, okay. Um, wait, what? Uh, you little shit. I'm gonna go, I'm not gonna go anywhere near you. I'm gonna go up here, because I don't know what this is. All right. Was that like one rupee or one gill? Did I just like literally pick gill out of the air? Well, there's two. Oh, right. Ah, uh, that's right. I've in my head. I keep on forgetting that you. This is actually like a rule dodge jump. That sprint. Um. Okay. So this is interesting. Oh. I'm going to go up here and get these things. So I don't know what they are, but they seem to be collectible. And if they're collectible, then there's something going on here that I need to know about. Um. More gems! More gems! Get all the gems! Collect them all! Collect them all! Big gems! Small gems! All the gems! Woohoo! What's this? Whoa. Um. Shit. 
Hi, Titan? Um, right, whatever the fuck that was. Okay. Let's stop exploring randomly and go to where they want me to go. Let, let's follow the plot line here. Now, the animation quality is pretty damn cool. I mean, look at this. I mean, it, it's a linear kind of like corridor to be running down, which is the one thing that we all fear for Final Fantasy. But we're actually controlling the jumps. We're moving around here. We're platforming. It kind of reminds me a lot more of Kingdom Hearts currently than anything else. Uh, that dude faded away, thankfully. More gems! Gems, 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 gems. Give me all the gems. Yummy, yummy gems. Nom, 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 nom. Whoa, 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 whoa. Tuck and roll, kid. Tuck and roll. Ooh. Oh, look at the splashy water. You haven't just dozed off. You're out cold. All right. If you want to wake up and see everyone again, we're going to have to find the exit. All right. Okay. So that's what this is. This is actually like a coma dream. Works for me. So what's this? Oh, it's a time. Time sped up. Oh, weather's... Oh, cool. So the day's passing by faster. That's kind of cool. Yeah. So, uh, it's showing us, like, the kind of, like, the weather effects and stuff that are actually being done on this. So, this is really kind of, like, a very linear tech... Linear playable tech demo. Just stick with me and you'll be okay. Whoa. Okay, birds. Um, yep. Jump onto this one. Oh, the weather changed. Uh, okay. That's kind of cool. I can get on board with that. So, jump up here. Jump up here. And get more gems. Gems, gems, gems. Gems, gems, gems. Like my gems. Can we climb? No. Nope. Can't climb yet. Gems! Did we get all the gems? No, nope, we didn't get all the gems. Gem! There we go. Now we got all the gems. Okay. Um. They do not look too friendly. Okay, thank you. Did I get a sword? I got swords. Okay. Uh, equipment uh, for size. Start by pressing that button. Okay. So we're going to press this. And we put on squeaky hammer. And toy sword. Actually, in fact, I want toy sword first. Uh, to remove. Okay. And remove. And I want toy sword and squeaky hammer. One, two, three, four, five. Squeaky hammer. One, two, three, four, five. Squeaky hammer. Bring it on. So yeah. Squeaky hammer. So I get how the weapon in combat is actually, you kind of summon a weapon up as you need it. So, um, fuck that. I see gems. Find what? Okay. What the hell just happened there? So I don't top circle? I thought it was a... Oh, whoa! Yeah, this is such a Kingdom Hearts kind of fucking things going on here. I mean, I've literally done this in Kingdom Hearts before with the, the giant place. Although, it makes sense. I mean, it allows them to actually, like, show the scope of a place. You get, like, these. Fireworks? 
Hold trying What is that? Hold circle to grab a bomb. Aim with L. Then let go. Okay. And this is for day and night cycle? Well, I'm going to keep it as day if that's alright. This plate is locked. Okay. Give me a vehicle to move around in. There we go. Brum 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 right up your ass. Right up your ass. You find what? Where did you go? You little shit? To now what? What the hell just happened? What? Okay. Oh, that's yeah, fine. Jesus. Um, can you get up there? Or at least if I follow the trail, it might lead me there. Bad guys! This is a good start. Come here, you little shits. Anyway, let's get up here and jump, bitty jump. See, just the fact that all these things are actually objects that are in the world, and whenever we're in full size, like this miniature version is just us getting a close up look at the textures of this game, which is a very, very smart way to show um, the scale and scope of some of the objects that we're playing with. Like, I mean, the, 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 what the game's trying to do. Uh, you fucks, come here. Ow! Ah! Boom! Off the edge! That's what I wanted. So, that's combat done. Um, I don't know if I can actually lift up objects, can I? Oh, I can move on. This is fun. I'm actually enjoying myself just even wandering around this bit. Um. Hmm. Thunderball. I must actually need to find out what these are. Oh, right. Okay. Get it now. What? Fun, fun, fun. So, what I need to do now is just follow away. Okay, now I can see where the tunnel is. So, I've got to follow these little circles to get myself to the next one. More gems! Right, down through here, and we're ready to rock and roll. Just need to grab some more gems. Gems, gems, gems. Gems, 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 gems. Gems, 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 gems. Each one of these seem to be actually worth 10 whenever they're actually the um, larger ones, but... Let's see the volume doing this otherwise. Okay, come on. Time to go! Oh, okay. Now they're just showing off their weather physics. Sunshine on a rainy day. Sunshine makes my soul, makes my soul drift, drift, drift away. Sunshine on a rainy day. Okay, time for the karaoke dam. I'm not, we're, we're here to explore. Not to listen to my dulcet, wonderful tunes while I've got a sex beat. More gems. Keep on searching. And baddies. Okay. Slashy, slashy, slashy. Sword, sword, sword. Time for you to die. Ah, oh, you missed it that time. Mm. Okay, what else we got here? Yep, at least we can try a little bit of magical death. Come on, try it some ways. Yeah. Oh. Should we get him? Ah, stop hitting me, you... And squeaky toy death, squeaky toy death, squeaky toy death, stay down. You know what, whenever the squeaky hammer comes out, that's whenever I really mean business, you know? Bam! The bitch went down. Okay. Die, shadow dogs. What is this, anyway? Woo! Okay. Uh, that's a little bit odd. <laughs> Noctis just transformed. Uh, into what? I'm not too sure. Is that like some kind of wild boar? 
Okay. <laughs> well, at least I'm effective. <laughs> All right. Let's continue to explore as a wild boar. That's, that's kind of cool. Um, I'm assuming this must be just showing, like, character models. Because I don't know if transformation is probably one of the major things they tend to have in the main part of the game. Um, bit odd if you just turned into a monster every once in a while. Okay, that's it. I am sick and tired of this weather. Right, where is it? There it is. Happy days. Now I have to bring out some of the sunshine. Oh, it feels so much better. Oh, the ground's actually still wet. Yeah, that's a nice touch. So it kind of dries off as the weather changes. Well, uh, the dynamic weather system that's on that I saw them test out in one of their previous little kind of um, demo clips. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, new weapon? Upgrade the hammer. We must upgrade the hammer. Take squeaky hammer, replace it with radiant hammer. Let us make hammer death. <laughs> oh, don't change much. Oh, <laughs> nice, it actually is. Now one only needs to actually just jump across and move it over here. Oh, what shit? Ah, uh, oh, whatever. Oh, do you want to bring it on? Eat hammer death, you peons. <laughs> oh, death by hammer, the squeakiest of the dooms. <laughs> oh, man. Just wiping them out now. Boom, boom. Yes, you cannot stand the power of my squeaky hammer of doom. <laughs> oh, man. So, this is where we need to go next, right? One long corridor. Going down the corridor. Wow, it's, it's kind of nice and reflective and shiny and all, but this is one long-ass corridor. Yeah, Noctis, you do sleep pretty hard, so um, maybe it's just like the long corridor of your dreams. <laughs> okay. Don't go into the light. I can't help it. It's too beautiful. Oh, wait, what the fuck? Ah! <laughs> Minor little fall for no reason. So what have we got next? Okay. Um, oh, I recognize this place. We've seen this in nearly all of the demos from like even the early days of Final Fantasy XV. This is kind of like the um, front of a castle. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's like the Citadel Castle thing. Well, let's take a gander and wander around. So the, these locations all seem to be really disconnected from each other. It is property. Oh, it's a dream. What's up now, buddy? Ooh, 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 fuck you. You're going the fuck down. Do not fuck with Carbuncle. What the fuck is this? Um, ooh, an Iron Giant? All right, I know these motherfuckers. I've seen these in nearly every game before. Come on, Carbuncle. You me. Let's kick his ass with a squeaky hammer. This one will protect you from ooh, your okay. darkest dreams. But remember, Noct. In the world of your dreams, you are king. Oh. Well, that explains why Carbuncle's kind of like in this bit. Let's see, he's a little, his baby childhood protector. Oh, shit, yes, now we've got actually Noctis as an adult. Okay, bring it on. Let's kick some ass. Okay, um, nothing we can change here, is there? Okay, just defaults. Okay, whatever. At least we have fireballs. Throw that fire! Oh, shit. All right, I missed. <laughs> All right, let's just go down and kick his ass instead then. Um... Slashy, slashy, flash, fun, 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 fun. Slashy, slash, 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 fun. Dodge! <laughs> Alright. So we're kind of getting the idea of this combat is a little bit easier now that I've kind of got a bit of practice with the uh, other weapons as a child. Uh, yeah. So switching between combat and defense is fairly easy. You kind of just hold down one or hold down the other, and that kind of fills the gap for which one you're trying to do. And it doesn't help that he's pretty big and got a big ass goddamn sword. I'm not too sure about this longer... Oh, shit. Okay, I got nailed there. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Gravity magic. Oh, fuck off. Get... Mm, okay, you need to go the fuck down. Ow. Ooh, okay. So you kind of need to kind of time your dodges and your switch rounds between um, attacking and the enemy's attack, and it matters which weapon you're using. Are you meant to try and position yourself to get around them? You know, I'm gonna dodge roll and run away. Oh, okay, just die already. Oh, fuck. Um. Ow, 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 ow. 
see, and there looks like there seems to be like quick time events I could have recovered there, but I don't know how to do it. Um, especially concerning them, just like, this is the only first big bad guy. Ooh. Jesus, Jesus! Uh, the only big bad guy I've ever actually encountered in this demo. <clears throat> I'm gonna live. This will be fine. I'll survive. I've got Carbuncle on my side anyway, like he's probably not gonna let me die. Oof. So, come on, we're not too sure if we're gonna be able to finish him off. Alright, oh, at least Carbuncle's there to heal me, so I should be absolutely fine. I'm going to survive just fine without you. I'll be absolutely alright. Oh, shit, I've got him down anyway. <laughs> well, that's the end of the big combat. And that's the end of the bad guy. And that's the end of Aldo Noctis. Well, that's great. Um, so we're not going to play as him at all during this demo? Hmm, whatever. He's got his imagination. Alright, cool. Well, at least we're getting to see where we need to go next. Boom. Okay, I need to find out here because it's, we haven't got the chance to use it yet. The meteor... Rain, um, like we've seen the other magic, we've used it down to see, so we need to rejig these around here now that we've actually finished that combat. <clears throat> so, let's see, Meteor Rain. Holy fuck! Why the fuck have I not been using this the entire time? That looks awesome! <laughs> Golf Balls of Doom. Alright, well, <laughs> that's what that does. Your safe place is a car? Okay. Ride in the BMW safety. That's where you feel safest and happiest when you're at home. Okie dokie, Carbuncle. It's nice to see you. We're going to get in here now. Uh, the safest place is where you're going to wake up from your dream inside the car. Aw, oh, you cute little fucking piece of shit. You fuzzy ball of what the fuck. Carbuncle. <laughs> we shite would probably be the best one, but I'm going to go with, um, uh, what are you going to, what do you call, uh, I'm just going to call Carbuncle. Carbuncle, done. Yes, yes, he'll be Carl Carbuncle. Congratulations on completing the Platinum Demo. However, Noctis Fragmented Dreamscape offers only a mere taste of what's to come. In Final Fantasy XV, you will join a grown-up Noctis and, a dependable, and his dependable buddies on a journey across the immersive and expansive world. From all of us on for Final Fantasy XV team, including your favorite little magical guide, we look forward to seeing you again soon. So that was it? Yeah, see you again soon. I mean, like, that's essentially... The gameplay in this, the demo, is actually about, what, 15 minutes? But, um, probably more. Would I like to order Final Fantasy XV? Yeah, sure hell I would! Um, but not really today. No, I think I'll be fine. <laughs> You at any time it's like this is a genius way. Create a demo that's designed around purchasing the game. Well done, Square Enix. Well done to you. <laughs> so do we actually have like a cutscene ending? Do we get to see a new trailer? <sighs> Does that just take us back to the main menu? Yeah, that's it. Huh. Well, as much as I was excited and interested by this, I am not that excited and interested now. There's a lot of, like, plates that weren't available to be opened, um... I <sighs> That's a bit shitty. I'm, I'm not, not too pleased with that. <laughs> you can't even order it through the actual store yet. <laughs> they have enough data enough to actually be able to do that. Well done to them. So you can't even continue your little search that you'd done previously? <sighs> well, guys, ladies and gentlemen, this has been the Platinum Demo for Final Fantasy XV. 30 minutes of gameplay with very little to really show for it, except for how goddamn pretty the game is and how awkward the combat felt. But, um, yeah, 
I mean, come back and check out more material in the future. We'll actually be talking more about this game. I will probably play through it a couple more times to see if there's anything worthwhile really showing other than my little bit of commentary. But, um, guys, thank you very much for watching. This has been Derm for Pastiche of Skin here on Pastiche of Skin. You can get a hold of me on any other methods. You can get me on Twitter or on Facebook or on all the other things. Just remember, it's Pastiche of Skin for entertainment value only. I will see you guys all in the next video. Bye-bye.